Hi, my name is Megan. I'm the program coordinator of the LGBT Resource Center here on campus. My name is Toy Thibodeau. I am the assistant director of the LGBT Resource Center. My name is Nancy Jean Tubbs, director of the LGBT Resource Center, and this is Patrick. So what do you say is one of your favorite programs with the LG Center in Stonewall? I really love Drag Ball. It is a fundraiser to help support LGBTQ student scholarships here on campus. We also have a wonderful program called uh, T-Camp, which is an inter-campus retreat for gender questioning and transgender students. The Blackout Conference is something that I love. It's for black LGBTQ students. We've been hosting it for the last like six years. It's been going strong and it's now traveling. What would you say is the coming up process on campus? It's absolutely based on the person. We don't have a gay test for Stonewall Hall. Coming out, we assist students with that process and what does that look like? Because for not everyone, it's the time to come out. So only come out when you feel safe enough to do so. So we will advocate on students' behalf. We will support them. Um, if they're coming out as trans or non-binary, we'll help them navigate the, the academic part of the system, the, the name change process of the system. Really, we are here to support anything and all things LGBTQ related, whether that's coming out um, or supporting students who are already out on campus. Do you have any advice for people who are on the fence about picking Stonewall? They're, they're close to picking it, but they have some hesitations. I don't want you to miss out. So uh, I recommend, this, this is a unique opportunity at UCR to be part of a living learning community, to see what it's like as a freshman to build that community. You'll have other opportunities after your first year to explore other kinds of living arrangements, but who could beat being in Stonewall Hall? First of all, it's a fantastic name. And second, queer is cool. Students really gain a lot of confidence by not only living in Stonewall and accessing resources at the LGBT Resource Center, but just being part of the community. So I would say if you're unsure, I would just go with it and live in the hall because it's going to be a great experience. Living on campus is one of those experiences that you have to have at some point in time because it's only going to make you stronger as an individual. So what's your thoughts about the resident advisor that, that oversees Stonewall? They're amazing. <laughs> um, that's one of the things that's amazing about all the living learning communities. If you have, you have students who are very passionate about connecting residents to their culture and to each other. The RA usually identifies with being LGBTQ and somewhere on that spectrum. So they can draw from personal experiences and help support the incoming freshmen who are also navigating those identities. We real close. No, we talk talk all the time about different things and ways that we can program together and ways that we can um, make sure that this student experience is what it needs to be for the students in Stonewall and also for the students who access the LGBT Resource Center. So we communicate a lot. The Resource Center here on campus is here to support all queer work on campus. So whether it's on the academic side or the housing side, we like to build those bridges and build those relationships so that the this advisor for Stonewall wall um, can always feel free to come to us ask us questions get advice from us and we will connect with them to see what are your students needing are there particular programs that your students want to see so it's a very co-collaborative relationship do you have any final thoughts or statements for us I know it might be scary but we are here for you we are your community here at UC Riverside with the LGBT Resource Center and in Stonewall Hall I think just accessing the queer resources on campus and living in such a supportive environment will just make your freshman year college experience just that much better. I can only say that UCR is the best darn campus ever for queer and trans and LGBTQ students, etc. All those different identities. And I hope that future students will choose to be part of our family.